Now from here, we're gonna change it up a little bit. We're gonna get a little bit more advanced. We're gonna take our normal basic kicks that we just did, and now we're gonna add a spin to them. So from here, we're gonna go into our fighting stance. This time, we're gonna do what's called a spin hook kick. A lot of people in tricking use this move to set up for maybe a 540 or something more advanced. So setting up with our basic spin hook kick can also help us with later on tricks. So from here, we're gonna have a fighting stance. We're gonna turn towards our back shoulder. We're gonna take our chin and we're gonna turn it towards our back shoulder. From here, we're gonna turn and our shoulders are also gonna turn almost to the other side. From here, we're gonna take our back leg, we're gonna lift it up, knee up. This time, we're gonna do the same thing that we do with our hook kick. We're gonna hook it to the side and bring it across and down. Now from again, from here, fighting stance, look towards your back shoulder, spin shoulders around, lift up your leg, pivot high, bring out, hook across and down. And now I'm gonna show you the spin hook at normal speed, all right? Fighting stance. Now our second spinning technique is called a spinning straight back kick. It involves the side kick. So the spin from our pivot right here after we spin is gonna be the same way as we would extend our normal side kick. So from here, fighting stance, we're gonna do the same spin technique that we did with our spin hook kick. We're gonna take our chin and we're gonna spin it towards the back. Our shoulders are gonna to face towards the wall. From here, we're gonna lift up our leg high like a side kick. We're gonna kick with our heel. This time, instead of hooking it across, we're gonna kick it straight out in front of us. So from here, again, fighting stance. Look, shoulders go around, knee comes up. Extend, straight in front, and down. Now I'm gonna show you spinning kick and full speed. So from here, fighting stance. Now one thing I wanna stress with the spin hook kick or the straight back kick or any other spin kicks, you wanna make sure that when you turn your, sh your chin towards the back and you get ready to release your kick, you wanna also make sure that when you chamber high, you spot to where you're kicking, all right? So that way, when you extend your foot out, you have more accuracy and you have a lot more technique to it. 